Hi, I'm Dr. Laura. I'm a pediatric dentist at Virginia Family Dentistry. At Virginia Family Dentistry, we can provide three different options for sedation for pediatric patients. First option would be nitrous oxide, which is better known as laughing gas. Um, the next option is oral sedation, and that's something we do in office. The last option is general anesthesia, which we provide in an outpatient surgery center. Depending on the patient's needs and their level of anxiety, we can talk to each parent about their specific child's needs to see what better fits what we can do to better accomplish safe treatment. So first, nitrous oxide is known in the general public as laughing gas. It's something that is really considered the most mild sedative form uh, that we can accomplish treatment in office. Um, nitrous oxide is something that is inhaled and you don't have to take any sort of medications for that. It's something really helpful because we can titrate it to the patient's needs so we can raise the level and immediately reverse the level right away based off of how every patient feels. Next is oral sedation. That's something that we provide in office. We calculate the medications based off of each child's weight and their dental needs. And the, oral sed the purpose of the oral sedation is to make them feel really comfortable enough to maybe accomplish uh, more significant dental treatments, or even for older patients that might have really high levels of anxiety, that is certainly an option for them as well. The last option is general anesthesia, and that is a great option for children that might have uh, extensive dental needs, or they might be too young to sedate in office. And we take that very seriously, which is the reason why we go to an outpatient surgery center and we work with an anesthesiologist who manages the anesthesia, while me as the dentist, I focus on dentistry, which is my profession. So that's a really great and safe way to accomplish broad dental needs for a child.